John here guys and today is a very special day because I just hit 1,000 subscribers so thanks to all of you guys that have subscribed liked watched the videos engaged in the discussions in the comments it's been absolutely wonderful and today we're gonna talk about the original carbon bottom plate or Armitan Marmot frame that you can now purchase. But before we get to that, let's talk about a few statistics from the channel. I started up uploading videos to this channel in January of 2018. So almost 18 months that it took to get to this point of a thousand subscribers. In that time period, I've uploaded about 120 videos. And it's really been amazing in that time. Um, I've able to been able to get the channel monetized. I started adding some affiliate links around January of 2019. So thank you to anybody who has purchased some stuff at the links in the description below. That really helps me out. You don't have to purchase what I'm talking about. Anything that you purchase from those links helps me out tremendously and keeps the channel going. Somebody asked me the other day, um, when I mentioned I'd made 120 videos, they were like, so you've bought 120 products? And I started thinking about it and I was like, uh, yeah, I guess I have. Very recently, people have started to send me stuff for review, but the majority of those, over 100 of them, are all things that I'm just buying on my own to check out and review. So that's not really sustainable. So I really appreciate it if you click the links. Um, places have started to send me stuff for review, so that's awesome. And we're doing a giveaway. So the first thing that we're gonna be giving away is this bottom plate to the Armitan Marmot, which is the original carbon. Now, let's just, I'm not gonna open it since I'm giving this away, but you can see the flex of the original Armitan frames is back. So, and the carbon weave is a tighter weave compared to the space grade carbon. Now, I actually really love the space grade carbon, but after reviewing the Armitan Marmot, I realized that there are two different types of freestylers out there. There's the kind like me that like to get some nice footage every once in a while, do some little flips, some power loops, try a little bit of tricks and open wooded spaces over grass. And then there's people like my buddy Joe. He bought a marmot uh, from me. I bought a whole bunch of them when they first came out. And within a few days, he had already broke the bottom plate. And I think he's on his third one now. And I couldn't believe it. I was like, what's going on? Well, it's that super awesome rigidity that allows you to get that smooth footage that is also what makes it not for those type of freestylers. So if you're the type of freestyler, like the Rotor Riot guys, that likes to hit gaps, that's flying bandos, that's diving buildings safely with no one around, don't do, don't ever dive buildings with people around guys, just saying. Uh, if that's the kind of person that you are, if you like to try that trick over and over and over and over again, and you crash 19 times before you finally get it right, if you are like the kick flipper of FPV, um, like skateboarders do tricks and fall over and over again, um, then you need the original carbon. You may sacrifice a little bit of flight smoothness, but that flex is gonna allow it to stay in the air forever. And a lot of people were saying, should we just get the Chameleon TI if that's the kind of pilot that we are? And initially I would have said yes, but now that this option is available, I do like that the Marmot arms are a little bit thinner. They're more modern. I like the cage design of the Marmot a little bit better. And I like that the body is a little bit longer on that Marmot. Uh, and that additional length is gonna allow your build to go together easier. It's gonna allow some additional room if you're gonna be running a 6S battery on top versus a 4S, and of course your GoPro at the front. Um, so yes, I definitely recommend this. So if you have an arm, a Marmot frame with the original carbon, please comment in the description below and I will get this out to you. I'm gonna select this at random, but what if you don't have that, John? Well, 
Uh, so special thanks to Chris for contributing this frame for the giveaway, this bottom plate. So we can use to upgrade you. If you, if you don't have a Marmot though, what are you gonna do? Well, Surge from Pyro Flip contributed a ton of props, some straps, and the big thing in this package is you're gonna be getting one of the new Hyper Light um, Pyro F4 OSD boards. I believe this is the 2.2 or 2.3 version with the pit mode. Um, so this is really my favorite flight controller of all time, and it's the updated one. I don't even have this, but I'm giving it away. Um, you're also gonna get a plethora of HQ props. We got some of the new 5.1 by 4.6 by three Popo props. Now these can be used on regular motors as well, not just Popo. We have some of the three inch, um, which is the 3.5 by three um, V1S, I believe. Awesome, look at, the, look at the aggressive pitch on these. This is gonna make your three inch absolutely fly. And then look, the new little 2.5 inch 2.5 by 2.5 by 3 in green. Awesome. So if you are the winner of this giveaway, I also have some of those in purple, you're going to be getting this massive package of flight controller plus props. Now, I know that I have a lot of viewers that are international viewers. If you're one of those people, I also have a liftoff activation code for the liftoff simulator that I reviewed on the channel. So thanks to Kevin and the liftoff team for contributing that. Um, just leave a comment. Um, I'm not sure how I'm gonna do it. I'm not gonna make a totally separate video just to give these away. I think what I'm gonna do is do a random drawing and then the next three to five videos, look in the video descriptions um, for who the winner is. And if you are that person, email me at johnny5fpvshop at gmail.com and I'll figure out how to get you your prize. Now, if you don't wanna have the liftoff and you are international and you win one of the other prizes, um, I'm happy to get that out to you. You may have to share with the shipping. If anyone is in the continental US, um, shipping's on me, I'll get that out to you. So thanks again, guys, for helping me to get to this. Um, really awesome responsiveness by Armitan by putting out this second option available. I'm still gonna be rocking the space grade carbon just because of the way that I fly, but this is an absolutely necessary option. Um, it was really understandable how this made it all the way through testing. I'm guessing all the Armitan people that tested this are pilots that are more like me and not like those bando bashing freestyle people. So, you know, things like this happen, guys. It's understandable, but what's really nice is to see the response. So awesome job, Armitan, on making this available so quick. It's actually been available for a little while. If you wanna change yours out, let me know. Description below. Thanks everyone who has watched any of my videos. Thanks Chris from Armitan, Serge from Pyroflip, the whole Pyroflip team. Thank you to Kevin and the Liftoff team for supporting me. Um, once we get to 5,000, the, the, the subs are going super crazy now. I'm already up to 1,040. I just hit 1,000 last week. Um, once we get to 5,000, I'm gonna be doing a massive giveaway. We're gonna have bind and flies, uh, little quads, all kinds of stuff. So the faster we get there, the more stuff I'm gonna be able to give out to you guys. Thanks again for watching.